安全，注意安全。他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也不是人的，他也
20 kilometers away at the bottom of the line at Shisi, a steam loco is prepared to bring up the empty coal wagon. The gauge of the line is 762 millimeters, or 2 foot 6 inches, which was normal for almost all such Chinese railways. We join the train of empties in the countryside just above Mi Fung, where it's reversed. About half of the journey up the line has already been completed. Xianren Jiao, the climb is complete. The line now descends through a series of tunnels to Bago.
Beyond Bago, the line runs on a shelf above a small river for the last two kilometres. At Wong Soon, the exchange sidings are set out so that empty wagons can be delivered to the loader by gravity, with a little bit of human help. The stone being loaded into the skip will be sent up to the mine to line the tunnels as they're driven deeper into the hillside. Each wagon is carefully tidied, after which anything that overflows will be fair game for the coal pickers. The train with the empties arrives. Today it's running late and there's no time to waste as the passenger train has already left Shisi.
the loaded coal train goes straight off. So that means the empties have to be propelled to the loader by human power, one by one. Any coal mine produces large quantities of spoil, which have to be tipped. At Wangsun, this is done above the loader, with the help of an electrically powered winch. The skips return to the mine. These larger, newer ones are also now used to move coal. The name of the mine is Ding Xing, situated in Chanwei County. Despite the heavy load, the train gathers speed rapidly, ready for the stiff climb ahead.
the lineside weeds will feed the old lady's chicken. The track gang is replacing life-expired concrete sleepers. The waste concrete is used as ballast. The steel reinforcements will be recycled. Once over the summit, the train stops briefly for the brakes to be partially screwed down.
crossing station at Mi Fung features a reversal, a necessary layout, as there's otherwise no flat space in this area for a passing loop.
The other and much bigger remaining coal mine on the railway is at Yuejin, where the line flattens out for the last few kilometres to Jizi. We should be back here very soon. Jizi, the coal is unloaded. The Huangsun mine is separately owned and has an output of superior quality, so its coal is kept separate. Less than 10 years ago, steam reigned supreme. But with much of the coal going to a large power station at Shisi, electrification of the lower section made a lot of sense. And an intensive service now operates from Yuejin using one of three small electric locos. Most of the coal from this modern mine is brought up by conveyor belt in a continuous stream and transferred directly to the loading point. Small amounts also arrive at the surface in skips. And as we shall see in a moment, these skips also bring up spoil. Four-wheeled battery locos are used for power.
track gauge is 600 millimeters. The empty wagons arrive at the loader by gravity, but their progress through it is controlled by a winch. A typical load is about 40 wagons, and on average, trains run about once an hour.
With a much larger operation than at Huangsun, the amount of spoil at Yuejin requires much more complex handling. First, the skips are hauled through the hillside behind the mine by cable. The electrically powered tippers run on separate broad gauge tracks and the two of them are used alternately. The lake is actually man-made and was created by the tipping. Some spoil consists of large rocks, which are pulverized to provide a hard surface as the tip expands outwards into the valley.
slogan is a safety one. It enjoins workers to learn the lesson from the October the 4th accident. And as always, the coal pickers are ready to pounce on any remaining worthwhile lumps of coal. To end this part, we return to the steam railway. Firstly, the workshops, which are next to the coal unloading point at Chisi. Not all the freight traffic runs downhill. With no roads in the upper area, any construction material must use the railway. Cutting out the middleman. Before the bricks go up, an opportunity is taken to coal the loco directly. <laughs> 